Hey, like and subscribe right now, or you got to run 30 in the ring with Mike Tyson. I would not risk it. Hey, this dude will bite your ear off, so hurry up. Yo, if you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account, make sure you hit up my boy SportsTNB.com. Fast, reliable, 100% legit. Any account that you need, 99 overalls, any events won on that account, make sure you hit him up and tell me your boy two times sent you. Is that you, King? Hey, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, D, two times. Wait, hold on. What is it do? Two times crew. It's your boy, D, and I'm back with another video. You know what I'm saying, man? Hey, I'm back on my grind. 30K on the way. Hopefully, y'all having a wonderful day, man. Y'all know how this goes. But anyways, your boy, D, back with another badge glitch after patch 1.03, man. So go ahead and smash the like button if you haven't already. You know what I'm saying? But hey, anyways, first, I want to give a shout out to Charles2K. His link will be down below in the description. Y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to my boy. Get him to 90K subs, man. And turn on those post notifications as well. You know what I'm saying? Hey, y'all go crazy. But hey, if you haven't entered my 29K VC subscriber giveaway in the comment section right now, make sure y'all go do that as well for the chance to win some free VC, man. Hey, who don't want that free VC? I'm telling you, man. Also, tell your friends about it. They could win too. You feel me? Hey, easy. Easy VC, simple steps, man. Y'all make sure y'all go do that. But hey, hopefully y'all didn't forget. You know what I'm saying? Because y'all know your boy never forgets. But if you new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, man. Make sure you turn on post notifications. Make sure they see all notifications. Make sure you turn that like button blue. And comment down below if this glitch worked for you, man. Hey, let's get into this banger, man. Without further ado, let's get into it. Any console gonna be able to do this as well. So yeah, let's get into it. So to start this glitch, you wanna simply head to the main menu, then head over to my career. Once you get to the my career tab, you wanna go all the way down to start a new my career. Yes, you gotta start this with a new my career. This is the best badge glitch out, bro. I'm still working on the NBA one, so don't be discouraged. You know what I'm saying? I will have an NBA one for you guys soon because I don't know why y'all just don't rock with this one. I guess it's because you gotta buy the VC and whatnot, but don't worry. I know that you guys were telling me about the black top thing too. I have an updated method on that too that will be dropping. So anyway, what you want to do is head over to start a new my career. Obviously, find whatever player you want to do this on. I'm going to just do this on one of my uh, center builds just to make this more easier. And I'm also going to show you guys how to get through these games to get to the game that you need to be way, way faster. So it will then ask you, would you like to start uh, your intro to my career and go directly into the NBA or would you like to skip it? My bad. On this message, you simply just want to hit no and it will begin to load you up to the first game of the prelude. Okay, now look, obviously once you guys get into this game, now y'all remember in previous years when you was playing a prelude or whatever, it was certain games that you could not foul out of. But simply, once you get into these games, you're going to simply foul out of every single game until you get to the second college game, all right? So that's what I'm just about to do. If you guys don't know how to um, call fouls or whatever, so on the PlayStation, it's the big old button that's in the middle of the controller, and I believe on Xbox is one of those little... Uh, smaller buttons that's on the controller but yeah you're just gonna foul out like i said every game until you get to the college game and that's just what i'm about to do to make this go by way way faster so yeah i see you guys at the second college game i'm just about to foul out through all these other games so yeah i'll be right back Okay, now as you guys can see, once you get to this point right here, you are almost close to um the second college game, but you just want to pick any team. Now, for me, the teams that I use this um to do this glitch with is the Texas Tech, 
or the uh, Gonzaga Bulldogs. So in this instance, I'm gonna use Texas Tech. Now look, remember what I said, once you get to that screen right there, you pick your team, you gotta do one more game. Now the game after this is when I will start the glitch. So that's where I will see you guys once I get done fast forward and be right back. Y'all know it don't take no time, so yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, now as you guys can see, once you get to the second college game, you will see that you have two quarters and they are 10 minutes each. So within those 20 minutes, all you're going to simply do is go crazy, ball like get a whole bunch of stats. You got to go crazy, all right? You got to go crazy. Trust me, if you go crazy, you're going to benefit from this a whole lot. So that's just what I'm about to do, and I'll see you guys in the second quarter with some seconds winding up. Okay, now as you guys can see, I am in the second quarter and this is exactly where you wanna be as well with a few seconds winding down. So once you get here, you simply wanna do what I'm doing right now. Just hit start, go to quit, and then you wanna save and quit my career and it's then we will load you into the play now screen. Okay, now once you guys get to the play now screen, as you guys can see, here's where I'm at right now. All you simply wanna do is hit the middle button of the controller, right? Then go into your settings. Then go all the way down to application save data management. 2K21 will close out. Now from here, you wanna go to save data system storage upload to online storage or if you're using the usb you would go to copy to usb storage and once you guys get to this screen right here you simply just want to select 2k21 select the my career file that's at the top this will always most likely be the one that you use but if you can never tell simply pay attention to the time and date used but once you have found it simply select that hit upload And once that is done uploading, it will bring you back to this screen right here all you simply want to do is hit the middle button of the controller and load back up 2k21 Okay, now as you guys can see, once you've saved your um, file to the cloud or whatever and you load back up with the same file, this is what you guys are gonna do over and over and over. So you're gonna be able to do this about nine to eight times. All right, keep that in mind. Now, in my last video when I did this, I explained to you guys that you will be able to go to the NBA and still get progression from this. Now, some people did not understand what I meant by that. So in this video, I'm gonna show this to y'all. Now, as you guys can see, once your VC stops exactly like that, you just wanna close your app, all right? Now, y'all seen where my progression was at or whatever. So I'm about to load this back up and I'm gonna do the same thing one more time just to show you guys you can get progression from this over and over and over. So yeah, I'll be right back. Once you get done closing that, you just wanna load it back up. All right, now look, y'all remember what my progression was at or whatever, as you guys can see, I just got double that because I was at 6,000 progression and now I'm at 12 and you're gonna see that I'm gonna get a whole uh, rebounding badge. Now listen, when I'm telling you guys that you can go into the NBA, some people didn't understand what that mean. They were saying, oh, this sucks. This is this, this is that. So let me show you what I mean by you can go into the NBA, okay? So look, y'all see um, how I'm done, right? Like I just got progression from that game, right? Now, I'm not done getting progression. I said I could get you can get it like eight or nine times, right? So I got six more times to do this. But anyway, what I meant by um, having like, you can go to the NBA, right? And play games in the NBA. So listen, once you get done getting your progression or whatever, now I'm not done, okay? You wanna head to the neighborhood, okay? And once you hit yes on that message right there, it will then select, you know what I'm saying, will ask you what team you wanna go to. Does not matter what team you go to, okay? This is just for this. Now, once you have, you, as y'all can see, I'm picking my team and everything is gonna load me into the neighborhood or whatever. Now, once you guys get into the neighborhood, once you get here, like say you, you did the glitch, right? You got all your progression and stop giving you progression from that glitch. So once you get in here, you can do whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? You can go crazy on the My Career Games, go stupid. You know what I'm saying? Just go off basically. Now, once you are done getting your progression from My Career, you're done playing or whatever, and 12 to 24 hours has passed, here's what you would do. So you would go into your settings, right? Even go down to FK Save Data Management, okay? 2K21 will close out. Now, this time, you wanna go to Save Data in Online Storage or Save Data on USB Storage, wherever you decided to save that My Career file. Now, once you guys get here, you wanna go to Download the System Storage. 
select 2K21, and select the micro file that you um, you uploaded a few hours or a few minutes ago, whatever. Okay, and then you want, once you have selected, you simply just want to hit download, hit apply to all, and hit yes. All right, now once I'm done doing that, I'm gonna head back on to 2K21 and show you guys what this did. Okay, now as you guys can see, we was just all the way in the NBA, right? Once you download it back, like say after you've done in your progression, like in 24 or 12 hours, you know what I'm saying? After you've been going crazy in my career, that is just your like save point to get back here and continue earning the progression while you have earned progression from my career as well. Now, this is gonna, like I said, bro, this is the easiest way to get your badges, bro. Now, I had to test this out because look, information, we did get a new patch, so I had to make sure that this was still working. Now, there you guys go. That's the best badge glitch, once again, it is still working. Now, after this video is up, my next video will be another um, VC glitch after the most recent 1.3, because some of y'all were saying that that stopped working, so I'm gonna show y'all how to get that to continue to work. So yeah, don't forget to like the video, don't forget to that giveaway. It's your boy Charles 2K, I'm out.